Hello, Mastiva fans. It is day nine of Vlogmas and day eight on my countdown to Disney World. Just saying, just kind of had to add that in there. So today we are going to discuss headwear. So in the early 1800s, there was, okay, I'm just joking. We're not going to talk about just any headwear. We're going to Actually, we're going to talk more specific headwear, Disney headwear. It all started with a friend of mine was putting up her Christmas tree, all of her decorations, and she came across this. This is not awesome. Watch, go a minute. The ears, there we go. Red ears and a little bit green ears. It, ooh, it doesn't look green on the screen. Oh, there's blue. Now it's purple. Now it's nothing. Oh, there we're red again. So anyway, she decided that she did not need these anymore and said, hey, would one of the kids like these? And I'm like, forget the kids. I'm taking that with me to Disney World. It's perfect. The holiday season, all the decorations. At some point, I'm going to be wearing red. And this looks awesome. I love it. It's so like... It's almost just tacky. It's great. It jingles. I mean, it's going to be awesome at night when I'm walking around and these are lighting up. I can't decide if I want to try and make these like almost like ears, mouse ears. I don't even know if I can make them like out mouse ears, but probably not because they got elf. But yeah, I think this is supposed to be like a little candy cane. So we'll see. I could be like an alien. Have them straight up like this. I'll play with it. Comment below on any ideas. But I thought this is just too festive and tacky not to wear this. I mean, seriously. Like, oh, I'm just going to have to just go ahead. I know I'm looking in the screen. I'm just going to have to. <laughs> now my little antennas are. <laughs> I don't know how I want to wear this. <laughs> okay, this is way too much. Ooh, I can't. I can't get a snake. No, hold on. Let me try the. Let me. Can you see the picture now? Is it coming through? Is it still staticky? What about now? Oh, stay there. I'm going to get some aluminum foil. Okay, so. <laughs> I mean, I'm actually going to leave these on because y'all aren't going to be able to like concentrate on anything else <laughs> other than my tacky ears. So anyway, it gave me the idea to do a Disney headwear. I don't have a lot of Disney headwear, but I do have some. I have just your basic mini ears. And technically, I believe, because you can tell this is very small. Hello? Hello? Um, I think this was for a child, but I actually found it at a thrift store. I Lysoled it all up to disinfect it. Make sure there's no bugs crawling around in there. Ooh, waited many, many months and then decided to wear it. So I've worn this, I think, on one trip. Don't know, remember what trip, but I did wear it at a trip. Yep, just your basic mini ears. Yep, yep. Whoa, man, what did I think of this? You would not believe the breeze that's coming off these ears. It's like a built-in fan because these are not flimsy. These, these are really thick. It's a thick headband under there. So I should have thought of this before. Next up, these are actually my daughter daughter bought on one of her trips. Y'all have seen them before. Um, not just from here, but other many people have these. And on another trip, I decided I needed them and I borrowed them with her permission. And they just have never made it back to her room for some reason. I don't think I'll be taking them on this trip because... It's winter months and I doubt I'll have any pink, so it'll probably have to wait to another trip. And okay, this is totally not Disney, but I think I'm gonna have to take it anyway because it is festive. I normally wear this for my husband's company Christmas party every year. I have got to be the most whimsical person at the party because when I get older, I'm going to be them one of those really eccentric women. Like, if I wore red and purple hats, I would be one of them women. Yeah, that's going to be me because I'll be old. So I'll have an excuse to wear anything I want to wear. And it'll be acceptable. 
See, I got it all planned out, people. Yeah, I do. And I also have these. I actually wore these uh, last January. So they had some Christmas decorations still up. But I think I am going to take these and I might, might add to them. Tell me what y'all think about that. Comment below if you think I should uh, add these to, to those. And just to show you an example, I lost the ears. I seriously lost the ears. Now I'm losing this. Oh my gosh, where'd they go? Okay. I'm delusional. How do you lose ears? Seriously. Oh my gosh. See, now I really lost them. Okay, I don't know what happened. I don't know where they went, those first pair. I was going to show you the difference on how thick these were and the other ones. Were, oh, my batteries are still on. How to turn my batteries off. Oh well, I guess I'm not going to. I'm gonna show you something else. Ho 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 ho! Y'all have not had a chance to see these yet because I made these for my Mad Hatter t-shirt when we ate at 1900 Fair. And this is gonna be another vlog how I made these, but I wore these whenever I get to the June trips. Um you may have seen these. Actually, you might have. I can't remember. But anyway, I made that. I love it. I won't be wearing it this trip because it. I'm not taking that shirt. We're not going to 1900 Fair. I'm not meeting the Mad Hatter or Alice this trip. So that is for another time. But I did want to show you that headwear. I just took a quick break because I'm in the middle of cooking dinner while I vlog this. Multitasking. That's what mothers do. And I still have not found those regular mini ears. I don't know, did Disney come by and grab them from me and took off and run because that's what dogs do? No clue. So, out of all those, I would love to hear your comments on what your favorite ears or headwear is. Now I'm going to go on to ball caps. I love ball caps. I wear them all the time. You probably already know that because there's been many of vlogs that I've worn ball caps, which are really not good for vlogging inside because you get a shadow under your eyes. But I love them, especially at the parks because number one, keeps the sun out of your face. Number two, if it rains, I love having a ball cap on. It's extra protection, keeps the rain out of my face. And if it's raining really hot, it helps keep the poncho hood on. If you're wearing a hat, your poncho hood stays on, where a lot of times it, it doesn't if you're not wearing a hat. So I only have three, I need more caps, but this is one of my favorite. I just like the colors, I like the look. It already looks worn, almost like a vintage-y look, and I am all about vintage. Obviously, y'all know that because Mr. Diva is a lot older than me. I'm probably, y'all can probably, yeah. Ooh, is he gonna watch this? Oh, honey, you're not vintage. Really, you're not. And, see, again, I just paid attention again. It looks worn, it looks vintage-y. So I have my other one. And then I have one more ball cap. It is Jack Skellington. I will probably take this one this trip just because I'm wearing some black. I don't know. I don't, I'll probably take all my caps. I, I have no idea. That is my assortment of headwear for Disney. Hmm, I need more. I, I don't think three caps is enough. I don't think those number of ears are enough. I... You know what? The wheels are turning. The creative genius in my head. The, oh my God. Do y'all see the lightning? The lightning. Do you see the light bulbs? Do you see what, what comes out of people that are geniuses? I don't know. The sparkles? The pixie dust? I don't know. But you're going to see something added to this fancy little thing in the future. Oh yeah. Now on to today's Sum Sum Advent Calendar opening. So today is a little one. This is... Let's see what we get. Oh, it's a oh, Dalmatian. Oh, cool. Be drinking the water. Yeah, he can actually be drinking. Like Lynn noticed, well, we had said before about the little sparkles on them. He's like, it's like all the minis have snow. Minis? Yeah, they're like oh, the minis. Oh, like that snow. Oh, not Minnie Mouse, minis. <laughs> yep. All right, I wish we so got a big one today. If you've missed our other vlogs and missed all the other openings, this is what we have so far. That face 
basically concludes day nine of my Disney Vlogmas. I hope you checked out Vlogmas day three because that is the giveaway instructions. We have, what, four more days for the giveaway? You just need to be a subscriber. What, I'm not telling you. Stop it. You have to go watch day three because you got to see what the giveaway is even for. But anyway, you got four more days to enter that and fulfill all the requirements to win. And I hope you check out actually all the Vlogmases because there's creative ideas in there. Pretty much everything's Disney oriented. I'm trying to keep it all Disney, but we'll see because we've got a lot more days to go. And then starting on December 17th, you'll start to get vlogs from Disney World. Actually, I take that back. That's travel day. So I don't know that you're going to, let's say December 8th, starting December 18th, you will start getting Vlogmas from Disney World. So I'm excited about sharing that with you guys. Please like, comment, and subscribe, and I will see you at the parks.